Appalachian Wireless proudly brings you unlimited data. Unlimited data is only $80 a month for a single line. Four lines as low as $200. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless, an East Kentucky network company. Data speeds slow to 25 gigabytes per line to 512 kilobits for phones and tablets and 15 gigabytes for modems. See store for more details. The University of Pikeville is working alongside App Harvest in the goal of making Eastern Kentucky the high-tech greenhouse capital of the nation. The agricultural startup will break ground on its first $60 million high-tech greenhouse in the spring of 2018 at the Kentucky Enterprise Industrial Park. App Harvest's business is to grow tomatoes in a high-tech hydroponic uh, greenhouse facility. So I think they have 32 acres that they're planting under glass. Uh, they'll need some laborers, some people who work in the, in the fields as they were, but they'll also need people who are growers and understand how to manage a facility and package food and ship food. So all sorts of levels of educational opportunity there. App Harvest is currently operating from an office located in UPike's new Health Professions Education Building. The university is actively exploring the idea of developing a curriculum that aligns with the high-tech agricultural industry. The university is trying to be very sensitive to the businesses that come to town and we have been a part of the recruiting processes for both App Harvest and Enter Blue. So as we do that, one of the great things about the University of Pikeville is that we are a private institution, so we're very nimble. Dr. Burton Webb says it's important for UPike to help develop a high-tech workforce and diversify the economy in Appalachia. We're working very closely with both App Harvest and Enter Blue to make sure that the workers are ready for them when they come here. Uh, and in that way, hopefully, we'll be able to provide employees from right here in eastern Kentucky. Along with the university, App Harvest has received backing from Revolution's Rise of the Rest Seed Fund. In Pikeville, Shelby Porter, EKB News.